Hi, welcome. Um, Josie has only been playing piano since January. So we've, yeah. <laughs> it's very brave, very brave. My name's Jody, and I'm the head of school. And I see a lot of familiar faces from years ago and currently, and it's so nice to be here tonight. We typically begin events and meetings with a moment of silence as a way to fully arrive, be present, and to create space for the immeasurable. So please join me in a moment of silence. Thank you. In many cultures, graduation from high school is seen as the most significant threshold moment marking the transition from childhood to adulthood. Tonight is our opportunity to bear witness to the symbolic event for these 10 young adults. It is an honor to be here. I would like to introduce our director of the secondary school, Russ Bowen, as he is going to formally welcome the class of 2018. Good evening, my name is Russ, and yes, I'm the director of the secondary program here. As a teacher here at Oak Grove and with our very small class sizes, it's really easy to see that each grade or class has its own unique character or personality. This group of graduates is no exception. I wanted to think of one word to represent this class, and it was easy, and that word is family. These students are much more than classmates. They consider each other siblings. Their laughter and their smiles have never failed to fill our hallways and classrooms over the last four years. And now, without further ado, would you please help me welcome to the stage the Oak Grove School graduating class of 2018. Welcome class 2018. As I previously mentioned, this is a symbolic and in many ways a real end to childhood and the start of becoming an adult. For this reason, I want to take this moment to acknowledge the parents of these 10 students. These are the babies you rock to sleep. You checked their breathing when they were sick. You stayed up all night assembling that first bike. You taught them to tie their shoes, or at least you stayed out of the way while they tried. I'm pretty sure you drafted hate mail to people that hurt them, even if you didn't send it. You caught your breath the first time you saw them walk onto a stage or an athletic field, or the first time they stepped onto a plane away from you. I know about the late night homework struggles, the meltdowns and the broken hearts. You cared for them in countless ways, and you will continue to. But something real is happening here, and it is you that brought them to this moment. We thank you for sharing your children with us. Molly, Duke, Sarah, Gabriel, Aaron, Soren, Carrie, Helen, Francisco, Lee, Jeff, Kathy, Paul, Lucy, Scott, Heather, David, Simon, Kathy, Patrick, Marga, Drew, and Jennifer, will you please stand? Your children want to thank you. Thank <laughs> you. 
This is really a special class. They wanted to acknowledge their parents. Um, they are now going to perform a song for us titled Give a Little Bit. <laughs> 